I was a very shy boy. And I was 16, my father called me into the study and said, son, just got your report. You're not a very good student. You seem to have the habit of daydreaming. I'm gonna make an offer. Between this age of 16 and 25, I'll give you $10 a day to travel the world. Or you can remain at home and um, I'll leave you a very small amount of money to start a small business. You have until Sunday night to think about it. So I came back and decided on travel and it's amazing the education. I have a PhD in travel and I translated from what I heard, what I saw, what I experienced into ideas which evolved into a passion and then I do it. I've had many startups, 11 to be exact. And people have asked me why I've never replicated the same business. Well, when you've had the passion for one and achieved the benchmarks you wanted to, why would you do it a second time? Peter Monk and I, who has been my lifelong friend, we were partners for 50 years. We had the first stereo set where you separated the sound, more entertaining, and Claritone became a, a great success. With Fiji Water, I was on our little golf course on the island with playing a round of golf with Jill, and out came a bottle of French water that had been brought and traveled 10,000 miles to the island. It just suddenly dawned on me that there was something wrong with that picture that I bet within 100 miles where I stand is a better water. That's how Fiji water was born. I have no ambitions to create many more <laughs> startups. But of all my 11 startups, literally in this year, Wakaya Perfection has become an international brand.